Peace and prosperity be unto all his listeners watching. It's your girl Shay Miller, right? And I'm back with another video. And guys, I'm still working on like that beginning part when a video first comes on and you kind of like can't hear me, but you can hear me. Um, I'm working on getting me a camera. I'm working on getting me a new computer. And I'm working on transitioning so that I can have my studio and stuff together. But really, all things in life take time. Really. Like, you get studio equipment, you get things, you get the small things in the beginning. You use your phone starting out. You don't always have a camera. You don't have the best quality material. Um, and I forget that. You know, I forget that with YouTube. I forget that it's just starting. Though I've been doing YouTube for a while. I forget that even though I don't always have time to post my videos, even though I don't always have time to do things I want to do even though I haven't had all the time that I needed to do what I love what I enjoy and what I value most what is most valuable is that I started and that but what's more valuable is when I can be consistent and when I can be devoted and when I can do it on a daily basis without cease without stop and just love and enjoy it um, well, some things going on in my life right now, but I'm still making in progress. Like right now, my job, there's some situations going on like a, with a manager and I got a petition going for the employees so that the customer can, um, write their names down. Uh, the employees can write their names down, managers can write their names down because there has been the same issue with the same individual manager and how she speaks to us. And, you know, it's one thing to be taught to you. It's one thing to be talked at. It's one thing to be talked about. And it's one thing to be taught to like you're nothing. So at this job, most a lot of people who've been there are like old, oh, like they been there like 10 years, seven years longer some people been there longer people have been there a very long time and like i want a change for them going towards 2020 i want to be able to help them with that change so i'm going through the chain of command the power um through the power steps of people and i'm like making sure that they get what they deserve so that when I'm no longer there, they're not like being yelled at, they're not being mistreated, and they're getting what they deserve. Now what that requires, um, it requires me being someone who's courageous, me being somebody who's bold, me being someone who has to stand up. I absolutely hate that we don't have more people in society that will break their own silence and speak up about an issue that everybody's having. Why do I have to be the only one? And everybody there is pretty much older than me unless they're like the night shift and all the young people are kids. I don't understand why someone so young as me, 26, had to always be so strong. And I get it. I like defending people. I like to be a humanitarian. I like to speak out for people. But at some point, even those most spoken will get tired of those who are silent, not speaking. Because it takes a, a, a strong amount of energy to put yourself out there with the sharks to speak about an issue that most people are voices to. So I just want to guys say that next year is going to be a process year. Next year is going to be a bunny year. Next year is going to be a year full of uh, a venture, a year full of goal achievement, a year full of things that you thought would never happen for you. I hope that you have the most prosperous year next year. I hope next year goes well. I hope the transition of the rest of this year is the most prosperous, the most abundant, and the most achievable for all of us, you, me, any of us. I want to say I love you guys, and I'm still working on things at my job and I'm still working on transitioning so I can get back to the making my YouTube videos. But at the end of the day, I have to realize like I've started and I can't give up. 